happening today. This is encouraging. Transit riders in Miami-Dade County you can uh, ride buses, mm -hmm. the county buses, the Metro Mover, as well as the Metro Rail for free. I like the sound of free. This is all part of the phase two of the Better Bus Network system. CBS News Miami's Terry Hornstein is in Miami with more on what is expected. Free. We like it, Terry. Oh yeah, we like it a lot. Anything for you really. And today and going forward until the end of the year, Metro Mover, Metro Rail and public county buses will all be free. That runs through December 31st. And of course, this is welcome news for those who use public transportation in the county. But this is all part of a revamp of all of our bus routes here. And that is not uh, news everyone is happy about. Our team partnered with a local advocacy group and went out to the community, to people riding the bus, to people using the service today, and they start better understanding their needs. New bus routes are rolling out in Miami-Dade County. The hope, county officials say, is to create a more efficient system that will be faster and less complex for riders. It's all part of the Better Bus Network system. The changes include renaming or renumbering three dozen routes, changing the schedules for 26 others, and discontinuing 33 bus routes altogether. That includes the 115 Mid-North Beach Connector, the only bus on Miami Beach that runs on the Bayside between Mount Sinai Hospital and North Beach. Horrible. It's not affordable for us. It's not good for the workers. All of these people got out of four I need a bus, please. I need bus, please. No take the bus. The county is shifting resources to make this happen, from low ridership routes to more popular ones. But for some riders, it means losing their direct route. Their solution to us was that we should take a trolley and two buses to get to Mount Sinai to work. But despite some frustration, transit staff says they believe the new system will help. The free fares to offer everyone a chance to adjust to the new schedules. Yeah, the launch of these free fares, well, it is expected to cost the transit system $9 million in the short term, but they're hoping with uh, these easier routes, more people will be taking the bus at that rate of $2.25 come January 1st. Again, this runs through December 31st where you can get those free fares. Now, because there are all of these new bus routes, well, there will be hundreds of staffers, volunteers throughout the county at bus stations, as well as at the Metro Rail, helping people out as they get used to all of these new routes. We're live this morning in Miami. Terry Hornstein, CBS News, Miami.